Hi everybody and welcome back to a brand new vlog. Today is currently Wednesday and I'm dressed, I'm ready for the day, and it's just going to be like a casual vlog what I'm getting up to today, plus some exciting news, so I guess not so casual, like not so casual really. Um, so there's going to be some exciting updates, life updates in this video. I hope you guys are ready and prepared for it. I'm nervous, excited, all of those lovely things, and I also want to share some jewelry with you guys. This video is very kindly sponsored by Italo Jewelry. They've sent me a few of their pieces. I have worked with them before. Back around Christmas time, they sent me a lot of amazing pieces, which I'm wearing currently. This bracelet, number one, which pretty much pairs with everything, and I love it. Also, this ring. I had so many questions on the day of Larry's birthday. I had this on, and you guys were all asking me, did you get a new ring? Did you get a new ring? No, this is actually the one that they sent me around Christmas time. I still have my wedding band and then this one. And also these earrings, which are a staple. Love them. All of these will be listed down below. And then I'm going to share the new pieces. All right, so here is the box. And inside, okay, first of all, packaging, super cute. And then inside the box, we have two products. You get the Italo Jewelry Care Card. Also, you get the certificate for your jewelry, which is awesome. And here we have the two items. So let's see which one we pick first. I'm just going to pick random box. Ooh, okay. So this one, as you can tell, is a beautiful lettered customized name necklace. Now, I made the mistake of not telling them I wanted mine to say Mindy, so it came as the default setting in Rose. <laughs> um, so make sure if you guys do order this, you just make sure that you specify what your name is, otherwise they will send it to you uh, with the name Rose on it. So this is the first product. I thought it was gorgeous. I will say Italo Jewelry, their pieces are a little bit bigger, I would say, like the letters. Um, bigger than they appear in the pictures, but it does give you the exact sizing and description. So make sure you guys check that out. But this is the first piece. I thought it was, I mean, this is a staple. This is a perfect statement necklace. Um, so I will link this down below. Uh, also, you guys can get 20% off your order using my code. I'll have it written across the screen. It'll also be in the bottom of the description box. And then this is the next items. These are beautiful gold hoops. I currently have these ones in just because I was going for a little bit more of a everyday life kind of look today. Um, but these are freaking cute. Again, a little bit bigger, a little bit chunky, a little bit of a statement piece. But again, I couldn't pass it up. I love them so much. And they're heavy duty, so that makes me happy. I know that they're not going to be cheap. They're not going to be falling off. So again, if you guys want to order these exact pieces, I will have them linked down below. And I also wanted to add that it might take a little bit of time for your pieces to arrive because they are overseas shipping. So it might take a bit of time. So take that into consideration if you place an order. But yeah, that's the pieces that I have on. All right, so I'm going to hop on and just highlight a few of the main points of their website. That way you guys can have a peek with me. So number one, they have free shipping worldwide anywhere. How exciting. One year warranty, 60 day return, and 100% secure payments. They're also having a new arrival sale, which is fun. So let's just scroll. I'll show you guys a few of the things they have. So they have hot selling, they have engagement rings, wedding bands. The quality is incredible and it's at an amazing price. Then they have jewelry for gifting like bracelets and earrings and necklaces, stackable ring sets. Oh, that reminds me. I also want to show you guys the rings. So along with the other pieces, I forgot to show you guys these. So this ring, I ordered these as a set for Larry and I. Okay, so here are the two rings. Here was mine, and here is Larry's. Larry absolutely loved his, and my honest review on mine is it is gorgeous, but I'll show you guys what happened. It is way too big to pair with my wedding set. The band is bigger than my actual ring, so it's just, it doesn't go with my set. But in general, it's a gorgeous ring, and so is this one. So again, the quality, incredible. Just watch the sizing, because they are bigger than you would think that they are. Um, but yeah, I mean, the pieces are great. I mean, imagine this as an engagement ring. Holy crap. So yeah, 
I just wanted to add that, give you guys a little scroll through at the pieces on the actual site. I will have all of my pieces linked down below as well as the new pieces that I have. So if you guys are interested in having the exact same pieces or if you want to scroll around and look and see what you have, you guys can use my code and it's MIND20, M-I-N-D 20, short for Mindy, MIND. And yeah, you guys can check it out and I hope you guys do and I hope you love the pieces as much as I do. Now I need to pretty much run out, head out the door. I've got a few errands to run and then everything in this vlog will further be explained. So let's go. I gotta say bye to Larry. Bye. Bye, babe. Bye, Mink. Love you. I love you too. Mm -hmm. Be safe. I will. What are you gonna do while I'm gone? Weed. Weed. Please stay hydrated. I'll do it. You have a kissy hair. Get up. Love you. I love you too. All right, guys, let's head out. I need to make a few stops. Dermatologist appointment number one. Then we're stopping off at mom and dad's house to visit mom on her lunch break. Then I need to stop at Publix because I started my healthy eating today. Not diet, healthy eating. Water? No, I don't think I'm gonna bring it because the stupid thing doesn't fit in a cup holder, okay. does it? You know no. what? Yeah, no, it doesn't. I'll just take a big chuck. Perfect. And then I need to pick up some prescriptions. Oh, I need to get my face mask. I need to grab that really quick. I washed them, so they're over by the washer. I did make the mistake though of using scented detergent on them, which I'm not gonna be thrilled about because it's gonna be right around my face, but it's all right. All right, we've got our face mask, and I have a smudge on my camera, which I see. I'm sorry, I'll clean that off as soon as we get in the car. All right, honey buns, bye-bye. Bye-bye. I'll text you when um, I get there. Okay. Um, yeah, so let's go. E. You lock up. I'm good. Oh my God, I don't have my phone. <laughs> I gotta go back in. We did it. All right. I'll be back soon. Love you, babe. Hot. Bloody hot. Hotter than hot could. It's a very hot day in Florida today. It is like 90 degrees. And the reason I'm going to dermatologist today is just for like a checkup. They um, have me on medicine for my acne, which kind of controls the oil production in my skin because I was producing way too much and then um, my skin wasn't shedding enough basically in order to get rid of the dense, dead skin cells so everything was getting trapped. So in order to get a refill for that medication, I am due to go back and they're just gonna look at my skin, see how everything is going. So let's head there now. So I have you guys stabilized in my car. Uh, so I just wanted to kind of like talk to you while I'm driving if it's shaky, so sorry about that. I wanted to kind of update you guys on life a little bit. So basically, earlier last week, I was on Instagram Live, and whilst on the live, it was the day of Larry's birthday actually, our air conditioning completely broke in the house, um, which really sucks. And it's been doing it on and off, like it breaks every three to four months. And we found out that uh, the whole unit needs to be replaced, and I kind of <laughs> like a momentary upset, however, it was a few days before my, my period. Um, so I was like extra emotional. I didn't cry on camera, but I did walk away for a minute because I was just like so irritated because earlier I was talking about like exciting plans that Larry and I have uh, this coming fall. Um, so we're scheduling a fertility doctor's appointment basically and we have that coming up towards the end of the year and I was just so excited and talking about that and then the the unit needing to be replaced was like a setback which made me all emotional because you know all of that good stuff so that's kind of like an update of what is going on but the weird thing about the air conditioning unit is it's basically pouring oil out everywhere it needs to be replaced but what's weird is it started working the next day without any repairs so we kind of got away with not getting it fixed but it does need to be fixed because all that's going to happen is it's just going to break down again 
Um, so that's kind of new and exciting that's going on. And I'm just, I'm so excited for the fertility appointments. And I want to bring you guys along with that journey. And um, it's still too early to even tell you guys that. But I like to be open and honest with you guys and tell you guys actually what I'm going through in my life. And that is one thing that we're going through. So today, actually, I'm going to be calling to schedule that. <sighs> which I called them, I haven't told you guys this either. I called them back in June probably and I was asking about the process because we have decided what we're gonna do with all of that. Um, and I was asking like, is this something that take months and months? Because we're looking at possibly getting pregnant if all goes well in January, if all goes well. I mean, we can't predict, we can't plan. Uh, why is it so dark? I'm sorry about the lighting, but I called and I said, is it like a quick process? Like, how does it work? When should I call back if we're looking to get pregnant in December, January time? And they basically said to call them back um, in August. So that is why, I mean, it's the end of July now, um, but I'm just gonna call, just to call because it's on my mind and I'm thinking about it. But yeah, that's kind of like a life update and plans with that. And I know you guys are gonna be so happy and excited, as excited as I am. Um, but we all have to keep in mind too that it's not up to us. Like we're doing our parts, but really it's in God's hands. It's in life's hands. If it's meant to be, it will be. And fingers crossed it works. And I was debating, should I not say anything until I'm actually pregnant, you know, next year? Or should I bring you guys along specifically, you know, for the journey? And I just think it's only fair that I bring you guys along with me because you guys, have been on this journey with us forever well not forever but for like the last two years so i want to bring you along every step of the way so yeah i just wanted to update you guys on that and yeah, yay anyway so besides that uh i started my healthy eating and i had referenced it as a diet and i should not say that because i'm not dieting i'm not restricting Basically, if you guys want to do this with me, I think you should. But basically what I'm doing is farm to table. At least I'm going to try to. Which basically means I'm going to be eating bananas, apples, greens, veggies. Any kind of produce that's grown on the land. Um, eggs. It's not grown. But um, meats. Like basically from farm to table is what I'm going to be eating. If it's processed and comes in a bag, I'm not going to be eating it. I will allow myself like a cheat day here and there. Um, so today is day one of that healthy eating journey. So if you guys want to join, please do join with me. <sighs> okay, so I made it to my doctor's appointment. I have like 15 minutes. So I'm, I just talked to Larry and he has given me the go ahead and the okay to call the fertility clinic and um, schedule our appointment. I'm so nervous. I don't know why I'm nervous. Well, I'm nervous because it's life changing because it, it could go bad. It could go great. I mean, I'm just, I'm just nervous. I, I'm, I'm very nervous. Plus I'm sharing it with you guys, which also makes me quite nervous <laughs> to be honest. Oh my gosh. <sighs> so let me clean off my camera lens because I still haven't cleaned that dot. Okay. Uh, so let's call the fertility clinic. Oh, this clinic is LGBTQ friendly. That's so nice. Okay. So Shady Grove Fertility in Tampa. I don't believe this is the clinic that I called in the first place, but they have the highest ratings and they seem so nice. All right, let's just give it a call. Let's try guys. Oh God, I am so freaking nervous. Okay. Thank you for calling Shady Grove Fertility. Please leave your full name, spelling your last name, your date of birth, and brief message. If you are trying to schedule an appointment, please include the type of appointment you would like to schedule. Hi, my name is... My husband and I were interested in scheduling a first-time appointment for a fertility... Um, just questions that I had about that. We're kind of just looking at our options to see what we can do. Next, um, so if you could give me a call back, that would be awesome, and I would love to schedule an appointment with you guys. So thank you, have a great day. Okay, well, I went straight to their voicemail system, so I don't know, so we'll see if they call back. I'm gonna screenshot it, and hopefully they'll call back while I'm in the um, appointment for my skin. Oh my gosh, I have sweaty, clammy palms. Is that normal? I'm sorry. <laughs> why I'm so nervous. Okay, let's go in for our other appointment. 
I think I'm one of those that also gets nervous just because like, I don't know, I don't want to sound like an, oh, oh wow. I don't want to sound like an idiot when I'm on the phone calling and I don't know exactly what to say. You guys heard what I said. Hopefully I said it right. Okay, back in from Skin Doctor. Everything looks great. And I do believe the um, clinic ended up calling me back while I was in at my appointment. So I'm gonna give them a call back. For some reason, the number came up through Maryland and I don't know why, which is why I didn't answer it because they were actually calling as I was walking in and I thought it was just a random call. So let's just see if I can make an appointment through the app because I think the internet here where this doctor's appointment is, is like non-existent. So nothing is really even loading. So we're just gonna, we're gonna move. We're gonna go visit my mom really quick and then we will try calling when I'm in a place that has service. <laughs> All right guys, so I just had lunch with my mom and the appointment, our very first fertility appointment is scheduled for August 6th at 10 a.m. <laughs> I'm so excited and it's a virtual appointment. I guess the first one is and then all other appointments will be in office, but I'll know more then. So that's all I'm gonna share now because I don't know any other details. I'm hoping to be able to film parts of the virtual and then like just, I'm gonna write down a bunch of questions so I'll inform you guys like more on that information when that time comes. So that's already less than a week away, yay! Um, car is creaking, I'm putting it in drive. Uh, so right now though, I'm leaving my parents' house. I need to run over to Publix because I need to get a big container of spinach. We literally just went grocery shopping yesterday and I thought we had spinach and we don't. So I need to get a big container of that. Then we're gonna check on Larry, see how he's doing, seeing how he got on with his day, gonna make dinner, and then I'm probably gonna end the vlog, but we'll see, we still got time, we still got stuff to do. So let's head off to Publix. <laughs> How'd it go? It went very well. Thank you very much. You're welcome very What much. you been up to today? I have had a whole list of things to do and I've done nothing. Well, that's okay. You know, we all have those days. There's Lexi. Hi, baby. Let me hang on my purse. Take off my shoes. So, how excited are you that we have scheduled our appointment? Very excited. Tell me how you really feel. I feel very excited. Good, I'm glad. Well, we'll see, we can't get that far ahead, but we're just gonna take it day by day, time by time. And then I thought, Larry agreed with me, cause I really did debate on kind of talking about this. And I just think it's more, not inspiring, but I know a lot of other people might be going through the same stuff that we are. And I just think it would be helpful that we're showing the journey like as it's happening, not just like announcing, oh, hey, we're pregnant and then explaining how everything happened. Do you know what I mean? It's gonna be a long journey. It is, it's gonna be a few months, but. So it'd be nice to have everybody on board with us. Yeah, yeah, so if you guys are new or you're not new and you're excited, yay, and it's, you know, it is gonna be a journey. So we are officially trying to like actually start this journey and do our part and I will keep you up to date with how the appointment goes and what information and I'll let you guys know the questions that we're gonna come up with and I'm sure you guys have a lot of questions so more details to come but I am gonna end this vlog here I need to edit this video and have dinner and just relax Lexi um, says bye, bye. <laughs> alright guys I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Be sure to leave a comment down below, and we will see you again very soon. Bye! Bye!